Hey, my friends, it's Chris McClellan, the Joy Connector, and you are transforming your life. So congratulations and much gratitude for how far you've come and where you're bringing yourself to, where you're brave enough to let go and bring yourself to. So with that in mind, um, and with the full moon that is just passing through us, today is Sunday and uh, it's really kind of full moon day. Because this is the second Aquarius full moon of the past two months, it's called a blue moon. And it gives us really this opportunity to go back and see what we are truly ready to let go of. So whatever you circled, the globe around whatever idea was in your mind on July 23rd, something you might have let go of then or thought about, now's really the time to release it. So I was thinking, um, what about if this week your practice was not bringing your fears to your relationships? What happens, to put this another way, just as a practice for a week, what happens if when you felt fear over some kind of relationship, money, family, um, career, love, friendship, what if you didn't bring the fear in the form of a question or a complaint to the individual or to the concept? What if you paused you did a short meditation practice and you checked in with yourself in terms of what's missing and how you can support yourself in transforming that fear. What if we paused and went inside first before we brought something to the outside? I'm telling you, you guys, there's magic in this practice. There is love in this practice and there is deep healing in this practice. So I'm gonna give you some journal prompts this week, um, but I'm really gonna encourage you to, in your mindful meditation practice, in your journaling practices, to really bring some awareness, which is number one, awareness, acceptance, action. That's the path. First, let's bring some awareness to what are the fears? And when I get triggered in a fear, and 